Okay. We're going to do this wrong. Sundance Vineyard, so Waluca's still. Okay, so 2006 Sundance Vineyard. Sundance Vineyard. Waluca's still. Okay, cool. Um, oh, this is what I'm used to. So I don't think this is going to be an over the top, an over the top Syrah, right? No, um, not, not for my taste buds. It has a nice balance to it. Fruit and spice, I'll work out even more. So let's hope this is like a nice, you know, um, not like, you know, nice inky Syrah, but not like super full flavored Syrah, uh, which is what I've been seeing lately. Right. Um, okay, on the nose I got nice, some nice spice to it. I don't have a... Uh, any pepper, but I do get some good spice to it. Uh, I also get a little bit of cocoa bean. Uh, a little bit cocoa bean. It's going to be a little cocoa bean. You know how you got a little vanilla kind of stickiness that sits around? Like that. Lots of blueberries, lots of blackberries. Blackberry. A little chocolate. Light chocolate sauce sprinkled up on top of a little bit of a... Spices. Yeah, that's what I get. And let's uh, let's give it a plug. Don't drink or drive. Yeah, this is um very European style. Um, like a, a corn ops, maybe a, a roti, um, an Hermitage. It's just a little bit bigger, you know. Uh, it's not as uh, refined, we'll say. Um, but then again, you know, for a Frenchman, he was originally from Chateau Neuf de Pop, um, I drink this every day. and. That's a very good Syrah. I'm a big fan of this one. It kind of tastes a little bit like the Almaterra, what Almaterra is trying to do. Uh, this Masny uh, Allen program. Uh, Allen. Picasso? What's your last name, Allen? I keep forgetting. Italian. Anyway. Um, yeah, it's, it's kind of like that, Allen. This is, this is the type of wine that actually um, I would compare to yours. Not really too many people that would actually compare your wines to. But this one. Um, it's, it's, it's just a very nice rock. So let's move on to the next one.